Hi guys, this is Teacher SP and welcome back to my channel. So, pag-uusapan natin ngayon ang cylinder. Ano po ba yung cylinder? Nakakita na po ba kayo ng cylinder? So, ngayon, let us talk about it and let us define. So, if you are interested, stay tuned. Okay guys, so when we're talking about a cylinder, these sprinkles ay nagre-represent ng cylinder. Wala pong laman ito guys ha. <laughs> Representation na po ito ng cylinder. So let us define what is a cylinder. On the board, I have here, it is a solid, bounded by closed cylindrical surface and two parallel lines. Sarado siya. Okay? And then, two parallel lines. So, ngayon, kung pinatayo mo ito, this is uh, what we call the height, the parallel lines here. And, when we are talking about a diameter, this is the distance across, okay? So, from here, going here, pero, magpupunta po siya sa center. So, yan ay tinatawag natin ng diameter. Okay? So, ngayon, let us um, get the volume and the total area of a cylinder using the diameter. The given is a diameter. I have here on the board the three formulas when we are talking about the volume that is equal to pi r squared h. Alam, alam po natin na ang value ng pi is 3.1416. So, this is constant that the value of a pi is 3.1416. And whatever is the value of your radius, so paano natin makukuha mamaya? And later on, in our application, if I will give you a problem solving, paano naman po makukuha ang radius? Pagkatapos, if we're talking about the total area, the formula is 2 times the value of a pi times the value of radius times the quantity of r plus h. You do the operation first inside the parenthesis. And for the lateral area, that is equal to 2 times pi times the radius times height. So let us apply now our formula in our problem solving. Example number one, guys. Find the volume of a cylinder 8 inches in diameter and 13.5 13 inches long. So, dito po, hinahanap po natin, guys, ang kanyang volume. At ang uh, formula for the volume is equal to pi r squared h. Ngayon, bakit po ang ating diameter is 8 inches? Ano po ba yung radius? Pag sinabi po natin na radius, like for example, ito yung Pringles, from here going here is what do you call the diameter. From here at the center going sa any point is what they call the radius. Okay, so sa kalahati nito, ibig sabihin, whatever is the given diameter, divide it by 2 and that will be your radius. Okay, so let us apply. So our given in our problem class, guys, is we have the diameter of 8 inches. Ngayon, i-divide natin ito by 2 para po makuha po natin ang ating radius. So, divide it by 2 and your radius is equal to 4 inches and the height. So, the long here, 13.5 inches long, is also the same as the height. So, your height is equal to 13.5 inches long so you have already your radius okay take note pag diameter ang given kailangan i-divide mo ito sa 2 para po makuha ninyo ang radius okay and then you have already your height so ang long or altitude or the height pare pareho lang po yon. okay now we have already, the, the given are complete. So, what are you going to do is, you are going to substitute your given. So, volume is equal to, what is the value of a pi? The value of a pi is 3.1416 times the quantity of your radius. 
Ang radius po natin guys ay 4 raised to the second power times the value of your height which is 13.5. So, we know that this 4 squared meaning you need to multiply a number by itself twice. Okay? So, 3.14 16 times 16 times 13.5. Okay, so therefore, your volume, guys, is equal to, so if you're going to use your calculator, so everybody multiply it, so 3.14, 16 times 16 times 13.5, then will give you 600. 78.59. So, 678.59. What is the unit of measurement? So, we know that our unit of measurement that we are using here is inches. So, therefore, this is what we call inches cube. Or, you can also use guys as cubic inches. So, this is the way how are you going to solve for the volume using the diameter but what about if there is a total area so kapag naman total area ang hinahanap natin we are going to use same given so we know that the formula for the total area is equal to so total so we have already our cube diba so total area na po the formula for the total area is equal to 2 pi r, 2 pi r times the quantity of r plus h. So, you have to do the operation first, guys, inside the parenthesis. So, 2 times 3.1416 times the radius of, anong radius po natin, guys, I 4 times the quantity of radius again, which is 4 plus 13.5. Okay, so let us do the operation. So, ana, alam po natin na ang 13.5 plus 4 ay 17.5. So, 2 times 3.1416 times 4 times 17.5. Okay, so let us use our calculator in... Um, uh, multiplying that one, so 2 times 3.1416 times 4 times 17.5. So, the final answer is 439.82. So, therefore, guys, total area is 439.82. And what is the unit of measurement? The unit of measurement, guys, is inches squared so that's it how are you going to use or how are you going to compute the volume the total area given a diameter so i hope that you learned something today and have a great day everyone